tendency to think and analyze your feelings and relationships is strong today, dear Scorpio. You may be taking the lead on a household or family matter, and efforts to improve your work, chores, or health can also be quite fruitful now. A healthy sincere's connection between your home and work sectors can also point to creative ways to get work done on or on your home, as well as more cooperation with others that helps boost your productivity. Self-care efforts or taking care of others can be especially satisfying. As well, love is easily expressed and attracted today. There can be a special attraction to mysteries and hidden motives, investigations of some kind, and all that we don't typically see. A Mercury-Venus sextile comes into effect, boosting your communications. It's a time for pleasant discoveries. The moon moves into your creative sector later today, reminding you to have some fun, entertain and be entertained, and get creative. Unless you sleep until noon, the moon will still be in airy Aquarius when you get up but the uncertainty of the void of course moon in the earlier morning hours might cause you to pull those covers back over your head and get a few more hours of shut eye. The moon enters intuitive, subconscious driven Pisces right around noon, so at any point during the afternoon you might get a sudden, vivid flash of a dream you had last night. This is an excellent time to keep a dream journal. Gentle Pisces also urges you to take care of yourself all day today, especially if you don't have anyone else doing it for you. Pamper yourself with doing some of your favorite quiet, soothing activities like reading, taking a bubble bath or meditating. Getting outside to spend time by the water is a well-deserved luxurious break from being confined at home, but if that's not possible lots of napping can happily take its place. Who knows? you might be able to pick up where you left off in a particularly steamy dream from last night. Although the Pisces moon exudes an introverted energy, you might still be feeling the need for personal connection today, especially if you're separated from loved ones. Writing letters by hand to send via post doesn't provide you with an instant connection but thinking of the smile on your loved one's face when they receive your letter is almost as good, 